Let's get ready to rumble! It's the fight of the century. Who is it? It is the will versus the trust. Who will win? Well, maybe it's not as exciting as an MMA fight or a boxing match if you're into that sort of thing. But it is really interesting. And it's a question we have, clients ask us, every single day. Mike, do I need a will or do I need a trust? Let's battle them out and figure out which one's better. A will and a trust basically do the same thing. They say, when I pass away, here's who gets my money. Here's the trustee or executor who's in charge of distributing those assets and who has the duty to do that. And here's who's going to receive those assets and the manner in which they're going to receive them. Okay, good. Now we know what they have in common. These two fighters are good. A will has a couple of advantages. It's a little easier to do and understand. And it's typically cheaper on the front end to do. Wow, that's going to be hard to beat. Let's see what the trust has to offer. A trust is a little heavier. It costs a little bit more money up front. And it's going to be a little more complex maybe to understand and to fund. But let's talk about the advantages that are in the corner of the trust over there. Well, unlike a will, which is a public document, a trust is a private document. So if you favor privacy over publicity, then you might like a trust. A lot of our clients prefer privacy. Why? Because if you do a will, everyone in the world can look up your will and find out who are your beneficiaries and what you owned at your passing. Hmm, a lot of people don't want that. What else do we have? Well, if you own a company, then it's usually better to have a trust. If you have an LLC, a partnership, a, a C Corp, S Corp, LP, you name it. Uh, because if you don't plan properly and you pass away and that has to wait on the probate court to get letters testamentary, that entire business value could evaporate in a matter of days. Whereas with the trust, the trustee can get in there, tackle it, try to save the, salvage the value, sell it, maintain it, whatever they need to do. You also don't have to wait on a court. With a will, you do have to wait on a court and a judge to get you a court hearing and to issue, for example, letters testamentary. With the trust, you don't have to do that. So in Texas, I'd say it's a three to six month wait with a will through probate. And with the trust, your trustee can actually get start to work immediately, right? It's just a continuous document that keeps going. So there are a lot of advantages to a trust, but which one is better for you, I don't know. But I hope you enjoyed our battle of a will versus a trust. Call me and we'll figure out which one's better for you to have in your corner. I'm Mike Massey and I've helped over a thousand families with their estate planning. I would love for you to click below to learn more or to call Mike Massey Law. Thank you and have a blessed day.